Love it or fear it, AI is transforming our world really fast. So we put artificial intelligence to a special Latino cultural test and wondered how AI would imagine some of the biggest cultural icons if they had not left us so tragically soon. Richie Valens Richie Valens played a pivotal role in shaping the nation's rock and roll scene at just 17 years old. The Mexican-American artist, born in 1941 in Pacoima, California, gained fame with La Bamba and Donna. Here's what possibly Richie Valens could have looked like today at the age of 82. Freddie Prince Freddie Prince is immortalized as Chico Rodriguez from Chico and the Man. The stand-up comedian and actor born Frederick Carl Pruitzel in 1954 in New York City faced many personal struggles, culminating in his tragic death at 22. Here's what Freddie Prince may have looked like if he was alive today at the age of 69. And up next, it's Selena. Selena, the transformative Mexican-American figure in the music industry, born in 1971 in Lake Jackson, Texas. She earned the title Queen of Tejano Music and was hailed by Billboard as one of the greatest Latino artists of all time. Here, we imagine how Selena may have looked today, as she would have been 52 years old. Up next is Roberto Clemente. Roberto Clemente, the Puerto Rican baseball legend, was one of the greatest outfielders. He was born in 1934 in Carolina, Puerto Rico. Thanks to AI, this is how we envision Roberto Clemente and what he may have looked like at the age of 82. Pedro Infante Pedro Infante is the iconic Mexican singer and actor of the golden age of Mexican cinema. He left a lasting legacy with over 60 films and 350 recorded songs. Born in 1917 in Mexico, his life was cut short in 1957. This AI rendered image gives us a look at what he may have looked like if he would have made it to 76 years old. Frida Kahlo The renowned artist was born on July 6, 1907 in Coyacán, Mexico. She passed away on July 13, 1954, at the age of 47. Here's what Frida may have looked like at the mature age of 76 years old. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to check this and many more fun Latino heritage stories at nuestrostories.com. See you next time!